Hey everybody, and welcome to the Mr. Maple Show. Tim tells me it's not raining right now. <laughs> and it definitely is raining. I'm Tim, welcome to the Mr. Maple Show. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video, and sign up for our weekly emails on mrmaple.com. We had 10 new cool trees every Tuesday, 10 a.m. We go out here and talk about plants all the time. Today we're out here in the rain to show you Picea orientalis skylands. Hey, we're on the campus of Blue Ridge Community College here in uh, right beside Hendersonville, North Carolina. May technically be Flat Rock where this campus is. Lovely community college here in our area. And there's some nice plants around. So we wanted to get this one on camera and talk to you today a little bit about Skylands. It's one of our favorite conifers. And you can see why. They have a beautiful specimen over here in the garden displaying this bright golden habit. We actually had the privilege of going and seeing the original Skylands on the Skylands estate in Ringwood, New Jersey. It's the New Jersey Botanical Gardens. And this thing, is awesome. I love Skylands because of this yellow color that this thing gives. It's just spectacular. You know how I love yellow and being a yellow conifer, this is something that can give you yellow color throughout the entire season. Yeah, I love this plant. You want to give it some protection from the hot afternoon sun. You know, maybe not rain all day, but you want to give it protection from the hot afternoon sun until it gets established. So this one, uh, once it's established though, you can see this, this specimen gets a good bit of sunlight and it does great you're gonna actually get more of the golden color in the spots that are getting some hits from the sun. And being yellow, you can put this and pair this with your greens, your blue conifers, your red Japanese maples, and this thing's really just gonna give good color contrast. Check out my video on using yellow in your garden. This video, this yellow can do that exact same thing. It can give you that bright yellow in your landscape and garden on an evergreen. This is an awesome tree though. It'll end up getting about 12 to 15 feet in 10 years. So it starts off kind of shrub-like and then develops a central leader and really gets some really nice uh, size and as you can see a really gorgeous shape. Now this beautiful evergreen is going to work zones four through eight. You definitely have to be a little bit more careful in your more humid zone eights so the the cold tolerance is really what we rate there with the zone so you have to be careful in a very hot humid zone eight but an excellent plant to be growing all the way down to zone four. Picea orientalis skylands is actually one of the very first conifers that we got years ago from Nancy Vermeulen. She's the one who talked us into carrying more conifers on MrMaple.com. And she had this beautiful specimen there in New Jersey where she grafted so much cyanwood off the sides of it, she even used a, a bucket picker. truck, yeah, yeah, a cherry picker, to cut cyanwood off this plant. And so she had this real tall, narrow skylands. And one of the very first trees that she gave us was skylands. So it's a really special plant to us. We love this plant and I know that you're gonna love it in your garden as well. This is a plant that just gives year-round interest, some really good yellow color, and this is a tree that complements your Japanese maples and your other conifers extremely well. We wanted to get this specimen on camera. We know you guys like to see specimen-sized trees. We want to give you an example of what one could be in the garden and landscape. Hey, let us know in the comments section below if you're enjoying this conifer content. If it's worth me staying out here in the rain for you, let me know that as well. I, I might strangle Tim after this video if it rains any harder. He promised me it wouldn't be raining. We were in like torrential downpours when this started and Brian's been laughing at us the whole time. I told him he could shoot out the car window maybe. But let us know if you like more conifer related content on the Mr. Maple Show. We definitely have some fun conifer stuff lined up for you. Uh, there's gonna be some really exciting conifer stuff and some different conifer garden tours. Now we're in a mid-July here and we got a lot of these summer showers so I thought this thing had just passed on through. I thought it'd just be a summer shower just pass through like we get sometimes. Uh, it's definitely still raining but hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, share, subscribe and sign up for our weekly emails on mrmaple.com. 10 new cool trees every Tuesday 10 a.m. Take care. God bless. And have an awesome day.